Hi guy, today I show you 5 ways to fix Nintendo Switch error code 2618-0501 and 2618-0502. Method 1. Power cycle your home network. Remove the power cable from both your modem and router. Verify all lights are off on the modem and router. After 30 seconds, plug in your modem and then your router. It may take a few minutes for the internet to reconnect. Method 2. Move the Nintendo Switch console closer to the wireless router. If possible, place the Nintendo Switch within 10 to 15 feet of the wireless router to improve the signal strength during troubleshooting. It may be helpful to remove the Nintendo Switch console from the Nintendo Switch dock while troubleshooting, and then return the console when troubleshooting is complete. Method 3. Move any metal objects or electronic devices away from your Nintendo Switch console and wireless router. Metal objects and electronic devices may interfere with wireless signals. If you have any of these, such as filing cabinets, speakers, power strips, glass, or cordless phones, next to your console or wireless router, move them away. Method 4. Switching to Google DNS. From the home window of your Nintendo Switch console, choose System Settings, Gear Icon. Once you're inside the System Settings menu, select the Internet tab from the menu on the left, then move over to the right menu, and choose Internet Settings. Next, your console will start generating a list with all the available Wi-Fi connections. Once the list is fully populated, select your Wi-Fi connection from the list under Registered Networks. After you select the correct network settings, choose Change Settings, then scroll down to the DNS Settings menu. Next, adjust the menu to say Manual so you can edit the DNS. Now, under Primary DNS, press and hold the B button to delete the current value, then add 8.8.8.8 .8 .8 and press A to save the configuration. Under Secondary DNS, press and hold the B button to delete the existing secondary DNS. Next, delete the existing value as you did before and add 8.8.4.4 and press A to save the changes. Attempt to reconnect again and see if the connection is successful this time. Method 5. Resetting your router. If supported by your router, connect to a different wireless band. Many routers support both the 2.4 GHz and 5 GHz frequency bands. If your router supports both, set up a new internet connection and connect to the band you are not currently connecting to. Many routers will have default SSID names that label whether the connection is 2.4 GHz or 5 GHz, but if you're not sure, you can review this information within your router's settings. 